Okay, welcome everyone. Welcome to the call. We are getting this started right now. It is 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Uh, we're gonna give it just a second for everyone to get on the call. As you're jumping on, make sure to let us know where you're coming in from. It's always fun to see which part of the world uh, that people are joining us from. So welcome again, everyone, welcome. Let us know where you're coming in from. We have Bakersfield, California, Rockwall, Texas, another California, a lot of people in California actually. Chicago, San Diego, Montana. Awesome. We have our Canadians in the house here. Good. Good to see everyone. We are excited to be on this call. We love holding these countdown to convention calls. Uh, so welcome again. We have uh, individuals from Boston. We have South Dakota, Illinois, Ohio, uh, more Canada. Fantastic. Good. We're gonna get this started in just probably another 15, 20 seconds maybe, let people jump on, and then we're gonna get right into the content of our call. We have some amazing guests, uh, which I'm going to uh, introduce in just a couple of moments here. Um, but let's, let's get on the call, jump on, tell us where you're from. And again, we're gonna get this started real quick here. All right, Texas, San Antonio, Montana, Massachusetts, awesome. Okay, everyone, let's get this started. This is our countdown to convention call. It's our third call. Uh, as, as a reminder, this call happens every single Wednesday night at 6 time up until convention. Uh, we've had two calls already. We've had uh, Mr. James Bradford, Double Red Diamond on our first call, along with Green Diamond, Ricky Brown. Uh, we also, last call, we, we had Travis Garza on that call. And then our last call, we have Mr. Carl Taylor. Uh, we also introduced Jillian Barkum, uh, who's a new dietitian uh, that's working with us. So we've had some incredible calls and we want to continue that tonight with another great countdown to convention call. So before I turn it over to our guests, I wanna just give a couple of announcements, a couple of reminders here. Um, first of all, the upgrade challenge, your opportunity to earn a laptop, a MacBook Air computer, uh, which I know Mrs. Mary Millward is excited about. Uh, it, is, it is the opportunity to earn it. This is the final month. April is the last month to get that computer. All of the requirements for that are in our back office. If you have any questions, you can check there. You can call our customer service team. They're always happy to help. But get yourself a, a laptop. Uh, earn yourself a laptop. All right, so that's still going on. Also, we announced this yesterday. This is brand new. A couple of promotions going on from yesterday through the end of April, we announced a new lower price point starter pack. So if someone is looking for an opportunity to make a little extra money during these times, we have an answer for them. We have a lower price point. We have a, an opportunity for them to earn uh, an extra income. That's a $199 starter pack. It comes with your triangle of health, a box of HL5, a business license, as well as one month of Kayani Pro. Incredible opportunity there, as well as all of our starter packs at 399 uh, being 10% off. So incredible opportunities here in the United States. Uh, I know there are people joining from elsewhere. You have other promotions as well going on, but I, I wanna make sure that we, we announce or remind you of that promotion. Now convention, uh, the live stream event, it's getting closer and closer. We're only five weeks away from that live stream event. We announced last week that it is from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. So remember to block that out, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. We'll have two sessions, a morning session, we'll take a quick break, and then we'll have an afternoon session to, to wrap that up. I wanna make one more announcement tonight, and this is exciting for us. Starting right now, we are, we, well, let me, let me give us some background first. We're so thrilled that all of our business partners can join on this live stream. It's going to be an absolutely amazing event. Uh, but we also want you to be able to invite guests. That, that could be individuals that you've talked to before, or maybe someone you haven't talked to and you want to, to introduce them to Kayani. This is your opportunity to invite guests. And we are announcing that a guest price for these convention tickets. Any guest that you bring can join for $29. It's a $29 ticket for guests. Remember, this is for guests. 
business partners, you have your tickets, and then we have this ticket for guests. But we want you to absolutely pack out the house, pack out uh, this live stream event with guests. It's an incredible opportunity. It's going to be available in the shopping cart now or within the next few minutes. So make sure to take advantage of that. It's such a great opportunity to introduce people to Kayani. This event's going to have, we're going to introduce new technology. We're going to introduce new products. This is a great opportunity. So take advantage of those tickets, $29 for guests. Okay, I went through a lot of announcements. Uh, I apologize, I don't wanna take a lot of time on this call. We have two guests with us. Uh, the first gentleman I'm going to introduce in just a moment, but um, as you know, uh, with these times, uh, a lot of things have been canceled, postponed, um, rearranged, and one of the events that we, we had to, to cancel was our Caring Hands trip to Chiapas, Mexico. This is one of our favorite trips, one of our business partners' favorite trips to go down and help the individuals in Chiapas. And we had a lot of business partners who were ready to go. Um, and unfortunately, due to the circumstances, they were not able to, to go down to the area. Uh, but we did still hold an event. We still, we're, we're still working on many projects. And the gentleman that I'm about to introduce uh, is the head of those projects. He's the director of our Caring Hands in Mexico. If you've ever met him, he has an absolute heart of gold, um, and he's down there doing some incredible, incredible work. So I want to welcome to the call, Edich Distel. How are you, sir? Thank you, Skylar. I'm pretty good. I'm really happy to be here in this Zoom call. So hello, everybody. I am really happy to briefly tell you the positive impact that Caring Hands has made in Chiapas. So I will share with you uh, some pictures. Uh, mm -hmm. Can you see my screen right now, Skylar? We can't see it yet. Okay. Mm. Okay. Technical difficulties always happen. Yeah, I'm happen sorry, technical difficulties. It's okay. Mm. Okay. So it says that I can't share my screen. So maybe oh, let you... Me let me change this real okay. quick. I'll make sure we can get this shared. Go ahead and try it now. Okay. What about now? It says you started screen sharing. Okay, excellent. So the the screen is black. Is it black? Oh, there we go, there we go, we're on. Okay, perfect, excellent. So uh, I want to tell you about a uh, project that we have completed, completed in Matsam. Matsam is Mexico. So I would like to tell you that 99% of the people who live in this community are indigenous. The 82% speak Celtal. This is an indigenous language. Community that approximately 350 houses. 21% of that houses have a television. Just 1.6% a refrigerator. Less than 1% have a washing machine. 0% have internet access. That they have a 100% positive attitude to take advantage of opportunities to change their lives. So for that reason, we choose to do a project in that beautiful community. Bathrooms and a kitchen. It, last year we started the first local labor uh, generating. But I mentioned that the parents voluntarily donated some hours of work helping us in the construction of the school. That way, care the part of it. And experience and experience has taught us 
that the most valuable results of working as a team with a community will be reflecting academic achievements. Hey, Edich, I think we lost you. Um, where, where you're cutting in and out. Edich? Okay. Unfortunately, uh, we, we were just on this call before with him and the audio was perfect, but it always happens uh, that when you, when you get on with everyone, something goes wrong. So we sincerely apologize. Edich, if you can hear me, uh, we apologize. We did lose your audio. Um, so we will hear more about this project and, and we'll probably post something on our, on our North America page so you know more about this project. Um, and again, we apologize for that. We'll, we'll have Edish talk to us another time, but uh, they're doing some amazing work down there. They really are. Uh, we've talked before uh, about the programs they put in pace, place with universities um, where, where they have individuals graduating, whether it's you know, school age students or those who are a little older that are getting degrees. It's an incredible program. We've built schools down there. This was a passion uh, of Mr. Kirk Hansen. It's a passion of Mr. Carl Taylor. Um, and Edich is the one leading the effort. So we just want to let him know how much we appreciate him. We love our Caring Hands program and, and the good it does around the world. And it's doing tremendous good um, down in, in Chiapas, Mexico. So thank you again. We're sorry about the audio. Now the next guest I have, um, this woman, uh, she is currently at home with six children um, in, in this quarantine, in this uh, shelter in place <laughs> environment. Uh, she is still working her Kayani business every day while tending to her kids while doing online school um, and getting that all arranged. Uh, it, she's just an incredible leader. She is a top producing green diamond. So I wanna welcome to the call, Mrs. Mary Millward. <laughs> Wonderful, thank you so much for the opportunity to come on and connect with you. And how many of you out there are kind of in that same boat right now where you've been the shelter in place and have an, all these extra, extra things thrown on you are kind of, I don't know, just had the rug pulled out from under you. Go ahead and just drop a one in the chat, throw it in there so we can all just kind of, you know, um, commiserate with you. Yeah, we're gonna see the chat just light up a little bit. If you've got kids at home, you, you get it. And uh, but I am so grateful for Kayani and for what it has allowed us and afforded us to be able to do to be able to stay home and have a career that actually is not only uh, you know, doing okay, it's actually doing very, very well. And how fortunate and how blessed are we? I have many, many, many friends, many neighbors who have let me know how many people they've had to let go. And it's just, it's really heartbreaking. And so I feel truly, truly blessed that we get to have this. Now, I love what that little part that we got to hear about what um, Mr. Edich said, where he said they had 100% positive attitude. Um, I, I just love that attitude is absolutely everything. And I have to tell you how excited I am about this international convention live stream that's going to be coming up. It is going to be absolutely epic. For those of you who have never been to an international convention yet, just you wait. It is going to be uh, amazing to have those in-person ones. But let me tell you why I am so excited about this live stream. We have been testing out, uh, we, we tested out a, a live um, live stream regional event with our team. And it went so well. It was so, so good. And it, in, in a lot of ways, it's neat because you get a front row seat. You're going to get that front row seat right there. You're going to have that amazing one-on-one -on -one connection with, uh, with the leaders, with the trainers. And you literally are going to be able to have that, that nice close connection. I got that being on the other end, listening to the other leaders train. And then I got that as I got to train, and I got to be able to have that, that it's a different kind of connection, but I will tell you, this will be uh, an exceptional, exceptional event. So I'm really, really looking forward to it. And here's what happens when you would go to convention, live stream in person or not. Um, when you go to convention, these are the things that are gonna happen for you. You're gonna get your belief built up in what we have here in Kayani. And, <laughs> and it's gonna be skyrocketed to a whole nother level. I will tell you that for my, my personal experience, is that had I not attended that first international convention, then there is no way that our business would be what it is. There is, and that is, there is one, I can tell you with 100% certainty, there is no way. Um, because what it did is as I sat there with my four friends that came with me, we caught the absolute vision of what Kayani is. We saw what was possible. We saw what was possible within Kayani, but we also saw what was possible within ourselves. And we started to really understand um, 
all of the good that was out there to be had and that we were worthy to have that good and we were worthy to be able to help others find that good. And then we turned around and just caught on fire. We shared it with everybody we knew and we came back and we, we said, listen, we are gonna be a force to be reckoned with after this and you better believe we were because we knew what we had here was so good. We had to share it with people. And that's what you're gonna get at this Kayani convention. And I am very, very excited for it. So here's a three part recipe I'm gonna give you. I know we're all staying at home. So we have to, we're all cooking now a lot more than we ever had. So let's, let's just give you a quick little recipe. First thing is um, we need to share this with our teams. And I'm gonna to talk to you about how you can share this with your team. The first thing is number one, you have to actually do it. Those cookies aren't gonna bake themselves, okay? You have to promote to your team. So you're gonna go through your list of people and all of you on here, by the way, are leaders. You are a part of this company, you are a part of this team, you are a leader. And so you're a leader, so your role is to take anybody, even if it's one person. Maybe, maybe you just partnered with us and you don't have a partner yet. You get to bring a guest on. How amazing is that? Now you can open this up to, to this, that opens up so many more doors. And so anybody that you can bring on, this is your job. So anybody in your team, you can call through them. Let me rephrase that. Call through them. Call through each, every, each and every person in your team and say, listen, I'm so excited for you to come with us to this international convention. We're gonna be live. We're all gonna, you know, everybody's gonna go find a comfortable place. It's gonna be a great, great um, experience for us to really focus on growth. You know, we, we've talked a lot in our leadership chats about, um, you know, where are you at right now? Are you in a space in the survival mode of like hibernation and just kind of hunkering down and just surviving? Or are you in an activation space where you are trying, where you're like looking to grow and to improve yourself? This is going to be the very best place for you to come and to improve yourself. And so this is how you're going to promote it to your teams. You just reach out and say, hey, we are so excited. We're all gonna connect up on here and, uh, and be on this call together. And we are gonna all grow together. It's gonna be such a great space for us to be on. In addition to that, so that's number one, we just have to do it. You have to pick up the phone. You have to call your team. And number two, we've got to, there's some really great ways to make it fun. For those of you who know Patty and Jeff Acra, there are diamonds out in Arizona. They are phenomenal leaders. They love to put together challenges for their teams and rewards for their teams. And so gather, gather up your teams and, you know, put together a nice little incentive. And for whoever, you know, gets the most tickets, you know, gets the most people on and gets the most tickets sold and gets the most people to come to that event, um, you know, can, can be entered into a drawing to win, I mean, whatever it is you would like it to be, whether it's Kayani product or maybe it's a Visa card, uh, you know, online shopping is kind of what we're limited to right now. So maybe that would be best, um, but, but make it fun and make it something that is, um, that, that's enjoyable. And just so you know, when you are getting your team on this international convention call, you are doing them a huge favor. I remember when Miss Tracy Peterson and Miss Julia Thornhill were like, you have to go to convention, you have to go to convention. I was thinking, why are they so like certain that I need to be there? Is, are they getting a commission for me going to convention? What's the deal? Um, but now I know. And now I know why it is so important. Like I said, had I not gone, our business would not be where it is. And I, and, and in addition to that, our level of impact would not be what it is either. And so I am so grateful that, that my mentors conveyed the importance of being on there. And so that brings me to my third point is you have got to be able to really cast a major, major vision to your team about what is, what's going to happen here. Now, if you have not been, then you, you're just going to have to live off of a little bit of the faith that you have from your mentors and, and leaders that this really is going to be um, exceptional. And it's going to be a space for us to really come in and unite together globally. I think it's so fantastic. I, I really think this is going to be a beautiful opportunity for us to really unite on a big, big, massive, massive level. Um, and I want you to remember that when you have that focused mind, that is one of the most powerful forces on earth. When you have really strong conviction, um, conviction is a force multiplier. When you sit down and say, I, I'm going to do this and I am all in, then from <laughs> then nothing's going to stop you. Nothing's going to get in your way. That's how I felt about my baby surgery. I needed to pay for my baby surgery. And that's why we, got, you know, Kayani found us and why we found Kayani. And when you have that conviction and you know 
then nothing's going to stop you. And so, um, you know, keep that, keep that in mind and bring in this mindset of absolute certainty. When you come to this conve convention, you are coming prepared with a focused mind, ready to receive. There's going to be so much great information. I am so excited for you to be able to learn and to grow. Um, but it's important for you to come in, um, in mind with, with a few things that you want to learn to improve upon and come prepared with a few, few of those thoughts and listen for those and you will get those ideas and they will come to you and you write those notes down and then you don't just write those notes down, you go and you apply them and we'll all be, you know, ready to, ready to go after that and really, really share this on a massive level. You know, plus I don't get to share too much information. If I, if I could, I would start to tell you a little bit about what I get to talk about. Um, I don't know, Skylar, can I start to share some things? No, I'll be in big trouble. You can share a little bit about your topic. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so I get to talk to you a little bit about um, some new products that we're going to be getting, uh, which is very exciting, and really how to build your business with these new products, how to create new opportunities, and I will tell you, I am so excited for them. I mean, genuinely, genuinely excited for what they are, and I'm so excited for you to be able to have them and for all of us to be able to share them in our business because it's just going to make uh, Kayani bigger and better. It's going to make this world bigger and better, and it's going to make you and your goals bigger and better too. So uh, I'm grateful for the opportunity, Mr. Skylar Stephenson, to come on and, and share those thoughts with you. Well, thank you so much, Mary. Um, well, first of all, I, I know we can't wait to, uh, to have you talk about these products and, and how to use them as you build a Kayani business. Um, it, it, we, we have some huge announcements, as Mary said, some really, really big announcements. Um, so uh, if, if you are planning on, if you already have your ticket to convention, I wanna see hands up in the chat. Uh, give me a hand or give me a number two maybe, that's probably easier. Give me a number two if you have your convention ticket already. You don't, get it, get it now. Uh, it is the absolute, wow, look at all those twos. It's incredible to see how many people already have their convention ticket. It's going to be an incredible event. Um, I can't wait to hear from Mrs. Mary Millward and many other uh, of our, our leaders uh, that we have planned for you. Um, so uh, remember, these calls are every week. We want to make sure that as we get near and near to convention that you are ready for it and that you go into that convention with conviction as Mary said, and that you come out with even more and you come out with an action plan. That is our goal is to get you ready. And I'm so grateful for Mary. I'm so grateful for Edith for coming on. I'm so sorry about the, the uh, issues we have with the sound, but we're so grateful for what's happening on our caring hands side. I'm so grateful for all of you for the potato pack donations um, and for the donations to caring hands. This could not happen without you. It's a huge part of who we are as a company. So with that, uh, we're, we're going to end the call, but remember, 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time next week. We'll be here right again. I want to thank Mrs. Mary Millward, Mary Millward uh, Mr. Edis Diestel for being on the call. Thanks, everybody. Have a fantastic night.